Hi friends, welcome to my channel. So my recipe today is going to be a no crust pumpkin pie. So let's get started. So before I started, I preheated the oven to 350 degrees and I greased a nine inch pie plate. So first of all, we have some pumpkin puree that I had left over, so I froze it. It's like 15 ounces. I'm gonna add that to the bowl. So make sure you use puree and not pie filling. To that, we're going to add two eggs. And one and a half teaspoons of vanilla. And three quarter cup brown sugar. So like always, if you don't catch the ingredients, they'll be in the description below. We're just going to whisk that all up to get that mix together and to that you're going to add one teaspoon of cinnamon I can get the bag open. Half a teaspoon oh, ginger. No, not ginger. Sorry. Half a teaspoon of ginger. Half a teaspoon of salt. And a quarter teaspoon of nutmeg. Mix that all up. Spices, mix into the pumpkin mixture. And then we're going to add in a can of coconut milk. Okay, we'll stir that to get that all combined. to get our pie plate. We'll pour that into there. And then as soon as the oven is preheated, we're going to bake it for one hour until the toothpick inserted or knife inserted comes out clean. So we'll do that and then we'll come back with the finished product. We'll see you soon. Hi everyone, welcome back. So I baked the pumpkin pie in the oven for about 65 minutes until it was browned and set and the toothpick inserted came up plain. And I'm going to let it sit on this rack for an hour and then I'm going to put it in the fridge for about three hours before slicing it. And maybe I'll put some whipping cream on top, we'll see. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, everyone. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye for now.